honestly, I'm, I'm nervous and anxious, but in the absolute best way. I've been looking forward to this day for a very, very long time. Danielle is everything I've ever wanted uh, in a partner, and I can't wait to see her. I'm 17 minutes before I walk down the aisle, I am feeling so nervous and overwhelmed with so much joy. So excited to marry my best friend. Marcus, I love you and this day is finally here after everything we've been through. I love you so much. Can't wait to see you. We've been through a lot this last year and a half, um, a number of different things, and it's proven, I think, to the both of us that we can really handle anything and that we're prepared to take this leap into our marriage. And I just can't wait to get started. I can't wait to see you. I can't wait to dance with you. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Mine starts a little bit of trip down memory lane, so bear with me, okay? It was mid-May back in 2011. I'd been living and working in South Africa for three months, and it was about time for me to come home. Despite the 10-hour time difference, you and I managed to talk at length every day, no matter the circumstance. I kept thinking, were these feelings a continent away real? <laughs> what will it be like to see you again? Yet after two planes and 24 hours, the only thing that separated us was a torturous walk through the LAX Tom Bradley International Terminal. After what seemed like an eternity, I couldn't even collect my bearings before you rushed through the crowd and gave me a hug that changed the course of my life forever. You didn't care that I gained 20 pounds <laughs> <laughs> or smelled like the inside of an American Airlines cabin. In that moment, your love for me shattered any remaining doubts, reservations, or insecurities. I knew you were the woman I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. Danielle, since that day, you have been nothing short of angelic. You have been my foundation, my sounding board, my internal source of motivation. That is why in front of our family and friends, I vow that I will strive to adapt and to support you unconditionally to the challenges we will inevitably face. I vow to love and cherish you for as long as I am able. Danielle, I love you, and I cannot wait to begin our lives together. My dearest Marcus, today I'm reminded why I fell in love with you eight years ago. It was the first time I felt free to genuinely be myself with someone. With some of the most incredibly fun, challenging, and unbelievably beautiful years behind us, I'm here with you to promise you that I will love you for eternity. Today I'm still captivated by your selfless, humble, caring, and respectful nature. Thank you for your unwavering support and for making me feel so loved, even when it's undeserving. <laughs> and most importantly, I thank God for bringing us together. I am truly the luckiest woman in the world. I vow to always support your dreams and to motivate you when you want to give up. I vow to express my love for you for the rest of our days together and to love you endlessly even when we are apart and to never take our union as husband and wife for granted. I love you unconditionally, Marcus. Me too.
Every young girl's dream is to find that special person and to have a wedding like today. And it was a very, very special day. When I think of Marcus and Danielle, the one word that comes to me is completeness. They complete each other. And it's such a great thing to see. I think Marcus has turned out brilliantly. And that's why he was able to get somebody as terrific as Danielle. I know when he met her, it was over. You know, everybody's got that one person in their life that just makes the difference. And that was always going to be Danielle. I, I'm just thrilled to death that you found somebody that can really make you the best you can be. I just couldn't be happier for my son. He's, he's found the perfect bride forever. Danielle and Marcus, in the sight of God and in the presence of your family, and your friends, you have celebrated your covenant of marriage. In light of your declaration and by the authority given me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may seal your marriage with a kiss. For the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Marcus and Danielle Withorn. Remember separately, you are truly special, remarkable people, but together you are complete. As you sit side by side through this roller coaster of life, remember to scream from the peaks, hold hands through the dips, laugh through the loop to loops, and enjoy every twist and turn. For the ride is much better when you share it together. Thanks so much for watching this film. It's really just our passion to tell stories that are raw, authentic, and really get to the heart of who people are. So if you like this film, hit that like button, comment below, tell me what you loved about it, and please subscribe to this channel because we come out with a new wedding film every single month and you don't wanna miss it. And then if you're getting married and want us to tell your story, click the link right here, fill out an application, and we'll be in touch with you. All right, well, Forrester Films family, I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great day.